Imagine a fish without water, can it survive? Imagine a country without good public properties, can we live peacefully? First of all, I would like to pay my highest respect to His Excellency Dr. Lee Cheng, Member of Parliament for Phnom Penh Capital and Director General of Belty Group and Lotum Thiel. Belty Management Team, Honorable Judges, Teachers, Distinguished Guests, Fellow Contestants, Ladies and Gentlemen, such a very good morning. Let me introduce myself. My name is Son Seda. I am a World Second Contestant from Belty International School Campus for Saddam Skype. Today, I'm very glad to present with one meaningful topic. Well, please put the trust into the bin. Don't overweight across the bridge. Don't work on the grass. As we can see that the government always warns us to be careful and take care of those things, like trust bin, park, bridge, and extra, which are the public properties. But why? Why do we have to take care of the public properties, which is my topic today? In order to make you better understand, I would like to explain the word public properties. According to the Cambridge Dictionary, it means land, building, equipment, extra that are owned by the government. Ladies and gentlemen, have you ever noticed that why do the actor and actress need to take care of their appearance? And why do the boxer need to take care of their weight and power? Everyone we do something on purpose. Certainly because they are benefit us as well as we take care of the public properties. First, for ourselves, hospital, public school, and every public properties in our country is very benefit for us and our daily life. You may wonder why. Now, I would like to take one of the public properties to concrete example. Everyone, what are you traveling on every day? Exactly, National Road. And what will happen if the road remain a road turn because we people do not take care of it? Absolutely. It is very hard for us for traveling and it waste our time when we go to school or work. Beyond this, it also can cause the other trouble like traffic jam or traffic accident. Thus, the maintenance of public properties is the same as the maintenance of our security and benefits. Second, for society. As we know that the government is the ruler of everything in our country, and they always spend a lot of money for reconstruct the public properties. Therefore, if we join it to take it of the public properties, they can sell money to develop on the other sector like education and so on. Due to this case, taking care of the public properties is not only for ourselves, but for the whole country. Third, According to the motto of Belty International School, quality, efficiency, excellent morality and virtue. This proves that morality and virtue plays a very important role in both educational system and daily life. Well, everyone, do you know weak person? Weak person is the one who always destroys themselves and others. And if you destroy the public properties, which the person are you? For this reason, we have to take care of the public properties because it can show your morality and virtue and also be a good role model in our country. In my conclusion, taking care of the public properties is very beneficial for us as well as for nation and society. Not justify it, but showing your morality and destiny of each one of us. One last mistake. We are the one who, who makes everything. We destroy public properties. It is like you destroy our own creation. Now, my presentation comes to an end. Thank you for focusing on my topic. My respect to His Dr. Lee Cheng, Lu Chum Tiu, and all participants. Hello. So, Hello, how to take a good care of public properties? Thank you for your interesting question. How to take the good care of the public properties? In my opinion, the good care of the public properties, if we can, like, we doesn't need to spend a lot of money to develop on the other sector, but we can take it by when you see, when you see something that, like, the, the cover of the trust bin fell down into the glen, and you can take it up and put it, and put it back. It is also can, Put it uh, like the cover on the trust bin also. And one more thing, uh, the go take care of the public properties is we should, we are people, try, try to jointly to take care of it. Don't destroy it because public properties is also the properties of our country. Thank you.
I highest respect to His Excellency Dr. Lee Chang and Lok Chamtia and all participants. Uh, my question is, can you name a type of public property you use every day? Thank you for your interesting question. I can use the public properties every day as um, public school. The public school is also the public properties, right? I'm also studying at the public school. And public school also can give us an education. If I tell us how to work on the right way, tell us how to work on the way that we can work on, like, to be a weak person. Yes, the public properties that I need every day is the public school. Yes, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs>